Well, I'm here, um, Gory Island. I'm getting ready to go to the museum, but first I wanted to just come and do something personal with the spirit. And um, this is a very powerful place to be because this is where the ships would dock before they filled them up with enslaved Africans and transported them across the ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, and scattered them in the United States of America, the Caribbean, Brazil, um, all over the world. And our people were stolen. Our people were ripped from the bosom of Mother Africa. And our people must return home. Our, our people must come home one day. All African people must come home to Africa, no matter where in the world you live. Peter Tosh said, as long as you're a black man, you're an African. You know, Malcolm X said, if a cat has kittens in an oven, does that make them biscuits? So you will always be an African, no matter if you're born in Atlanta, no matter if you're born in Jamaica, no matter if you're born in anywhere in the world. You're an African, so you must come home. You have to take time and make a pilgrimage, a pilgrimage to heal from hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years of slavery that has had a psychological, spiritual, mental, physical impact on our daily lives. When you look at what is going on in African communities, black communities all over the world, it's the same violence, it's the same crime, it's the same self-hatred, it's the same disunity. So in order to heal, we must begin from the root. And the root of our pain is right here, on the coast of West Africa, to the enslaved castles where they held us in different parts of South Carolina, Mississippi, Alabama, Kingston, Jamaica, Haiti, Dominican Republic. So we must return home, and we must heal, and we must claim our greatness. We must never forget who we are. We must always remember that we are the first people of the earth. We are the mothers and creators of civilization, the mothers and fathers of humankind. We are the beginning and we will be the end. And you must know this because we are the beginning. Hashem.